Good evening. Good morning. Good afternoon. Wherever you are. I was going to wait until tomorrow morning to open up my Sephora box. As you guys know, Sephora had a VIB sale, okay? I hopped on that shit at 2.37 a.m. and I was like, I am not letting anyone get the stuff that I want. I'm going to order it and I'm just going to spend the Mooney. So we're here. It is... 11 p.m. over here. I was going to wait till tomorrow morning because I already did a video today. But I said, fuck it. I have to do it now because I, I can't sit here with Sephora waiting. And you guys know because I don't get paid and because I don't have a ton of subscribers or Instagram followers, I have no reputation to uphold. So I'm going to give you the full truth. And OK, we are trying on a new uh, lav mic, by the way. So that's why things sounded like shit for the first 20 seconds of this video. So as I was saying, yes, I'm a very honest person and I like to share my honest truths and I also am addicted to makeup. You guys know what Sephora boxes look like, right? Like they're really not crazy. I'll show you in case you've never ordered off of Sephora before. There you go. You get your order form up top. I ordered many things. I ordered a couple Pat McGrath bits. I ordered, oh, I forgot about the Charlotte Tilbury. Okay, I ordered a bunch of really good stuff. Ooh, I'm convinced I could be a singer. We have a little hand cream Moroccan oil sample with Sephora. You do get to pick out your samples. Y'all know that. And then I got to try the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish. I assume one peels this up and then you can try it. Oh, but that's not the exciting part, okay? I've never ordered Pat McGrath before. So I'm gonna open up a little small bitty from her. Oh, look. So nice. Pat McGrath, batch of minis. I ordered this new trio. It's the Virgin Skin Show Trio in the Mini Matte Trance. And let me tell you, I love it. I'm gonna open it. All right, I have a dirty pair of kitchen scissors here and I'm just gonna open this up. It's the typical Pat McGrath packaging, which is very exciting. And I'm so excited to just touch these lipsticks. I've opened up Pat McGrath packaging once only because my mom bought some lip, oh, oh my God. Oh my God, and all the glitter that it comes with. It really is like an experience. Okay, so these are pretty mini, but if you guys are wondering what they look like, these are so cute and just so pretty. So yeah, that's what the little trio looks like. This is the size of my fingers, so you know. I'm excited to see, oh, very nice. It's interesting, wow, it looks like very velvety. This one's 1995. This one's called Omi. This one's called Flesh. I did want to have some extra nude lipsticks, so that Pat McGrath is great. Ordered this jumbo-sized hula bronzer. I had no idea how big the jumbo is, but the jumbo is fucking huge. I just love hula. I use it on myself. I use it on clients. The jumbo limited edition hula. Uh, I'll never get sick of her. I love hula. By Benefit, that shit is my favorite. So we got one of them. I want to save the Pat McGrath palette for last, I think. What else did I get from Pat McGrath? I got two different types of lipsticks? Holy fuck. I, only, I thought I only got the nude. Are you kidding me? This is when my past self surprises my future self. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, glitter everywhere. This is like Christmas. I actually didn't think that I got these. Oh, I got so much. Oh my God, okay. So we have a very nice little pink. That's very pretty. I'm gonna go through these so quick. I can't believe it. I really didn't think that I ordered that much. Let's see. 
Oh my gosh, very beautiful deep red. It kind of reminds me of Russian red from MAC. So cute, I love this like packaging. It's so nice. It's so luxe. And then a nice, I have a feeling that these are moldy and that's not how they're supposed to look. Yeah, this is weird because some of them have like white around them. So I'm not sure if these are old and that's what the deal is and that's why they were on sale, I don't know. Then I got this little milk makeup sample and this is exciting because I just got to choose some stuff for milk and I've never had milk makeup. So there's the Kush mascara that it comes with. What else? Ooh, this little lip and cheek product. I love a lip and cheek. And it's kind of like this brownie, I don't know, it's like, it's like a nice little brown cheek lip moment. It's in the color work. And then I think I got a Hydro Grip primer in there. So that's exciting. I really chose that just because I like a lip and cheek. I'm so excited about this. This is like a $97 palette. It feels so heavy. It's the Glowgasm Charlotte Tilbury face palette. Oh my God, it's so heavy. Oh my God, look at that. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's so pretty, like this packaging. Calvin, look at this packaging. Isn't that pretty? Holy shit. Oh, and it says Glowgasm Love. And then there's a blush. So there's a highlight, an overall highlight, a bronze, and then a blush. I'm so excited to try this blush. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's like NARS Orgasm and Coralista on steroids, this. So nice, and I just die over this packaging. Holy bananas. And then I'm gonna open up the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Liner, because I like to just overline a little bit, but I want it to be a natural color. And I think that this is the perfect natural color for me, my friend Kitty. She's a hairstylist that I work with on shoots, and she's just like, very lovely to me. She has a lot of Charlotte Tilbury stuff and I've seen her with this uh, lipstick and it's like the perfect color. And I can already tell on my skin, this is my exact lip color. So I'll be able to overdraw. And folks, last but not least, the iconic, the mesmerizing, heavy. It's so heavy, this palette is so heavy. Pat McGrath. Look at this, Calvin. Look at this. It's insane. And I won't be able to open it because of my damn fucking nails. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you unwind it like this. And then you can open up the palette. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is a box that it comes in. Look at that packaging, Calvin. It's amazing. Oh my God, it's so heavy. And then underneath, it has all of the eyeshadows labeled because Pat McGrath doesn't label her eyeshadows inside the palette because it would fuck up the aesthetic. Oh, I just can't, like, I'm not even gonna throw out this box. It's so nice. Okay. And this is my first time ever buying anything from Pat McGrath. This is like the most beautiful heavy eyeshadow I've ever seen. Okay, ready? I'm gonna open it and we're gonna open it together and I've never seen a Pat McGrath palette in the flesh. Okay, we're gonna open it together. Ready? Oh, wow. Crazy. I didn't expect, it's so interesting, like this one, it's called Astral Ghost Orchid. Wow, it's so interesting. It looks so icy in the palette. And it comes off so multi-dimensional. Like they really are so multi-dimensional. Like I don't think a camera could pick this up actually. There's two golds beside each other, two completely different golds. One with green undertones, which is perfect with the green. One with deep gold undertones. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't think that you could, yeah, like you couldn't pick this up on camera if you wanted to. You'd have to swatch it in the store. This is the most 
It's so beautiful. I'm curious about this. Wow, yeah, beautiful. Oh my God, this palette. I mean, it's a work of art. It's so gorgeous. This is what I've been waiting for for so long. Ooh, and it has a magnetic bit. I don't know if you can see any of these swatches or if they mean anything to you. I would say like go into the store and try them, but oh my God, am I excited to play. And you guys know I don't normally wear a lot of eyeshadow. I'm not sharing with any clients. This is my palette. Fuck all of you, I love you but this is for me, I'm not sharing. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Okay, so this is my really quick uh, Sephora sale buys. I can't, like I can't get over the Pat McGrath colors. These are the most, wow. This is everything. Um, I've made a mess, I'm tired. It's 11 p.m., honey. It's time for me to run a bubble bath, but don't you worry, because I'm gonna be making some beautiful looks with these things soon. We have some makeup tutorials, I think, coming up, or just some makeup playdates for you and I, because we have tons of fun stuff to play with now. If you got anything from the Sephora sale, hit me up. Let me know what you bought. Let me know if you like it, if you love it, if you regret it. It's always nice to save some money on makeup. If you like this video and you like all of my consumeristic hauls, leave me a like so I know that I should make more content like this. And if you really, really like my videos, please do subscribe to my channel because it does help me out a lot. I want to get to that level where we're making some dough off of this medium, okay? Thanks for watching. I'm so excited. Oh my God. I can't wait to wake up tomorrow and do some shadow. All right. Ta-ta for now, folks. Goodbye. Walk away before I keep talking. Goodbye. Get out of here. Go. What? No, I don't need it taped. I'm almost done. Titty tape, thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.